Hey guys, Mauro here. One of the most common things that I tell the people that I teach tennis is to focus what happens inside our bubble instead of paying attention to um, the shot itself, to where the ball is going, if they, made, if they hit the ball in or, or out. It's very common that when they focus on the ball, they get frustrated because they don't really, they're not really paying attention what happens or the things that they can control, which is the technique, the footwork, um, whatever they need to do, where they're standing, paying attention to the opponent and see, reading the, the, the body language of the opponent to see if the, if the opponent is having trouble hitting the shot so you can anticipate and you can expect where the incoming shot is going. I mean, there are so many things that, that you need to pay attention to that happens naturally as you do it more often. And that when they start paying attention to what is the result or the, or the tennis ball itself, flying long or, or, or flying out, they start getting frustrated. So they, they kind of lose the perspective of what they're doing. Okay, pay attention first what happens in your bubble. What happens in here close to you, the things that you can control, which is the technique and the footwork and the things that we just went through. And it's the same thing that you, uh, that's the same thing that you want to apply in life. There is nothing we can control but what we're thinking and what we're doing. Our actions, our perceptions, the way you're thinking, the way of our emotions, how we react to things. When we start paying attention to external things, like, okay, did, I, did, did, did it turn out the way I want it? Um, is it gonna happen the way I want, when I want? Um, or, or, or we get pissed because many times of a coworker or someone else that you don't like actions or things that they do or the way they behave, and the thing is, that thing is just not gonna change. It's, it's period. That's as simple as that. It is not going to change. You either adapt to that and focus on the things that you have control, like how you're working, what you're doing about it, how you're reacting. You gotta, you, you gotta be mindful of to see the, you, the way you think and the way you react and your perceptions and your emotions and how you process things be aware of yourself be aware of happening around you but I mean right here the things that you have control not not what is not what's really happening not even in the front desk or the or the guy next to you because the truth is that we have no control of that so remember in tennis I say you, you gotta focus what happens in your bubble if you take care of the technique if you take care of your footwork if they take care of all that stuff you don't even have to focus on the result. It will take care of itself. And the same thing is, this, I, I think the same thing is that what you want to do when you're at work or when you're at home or when you're at school. You just, you just got to focus on the things that you're supposed to do that you have to do. And focus on what's happening inside your head, not in other people's head. Not complaining, why, why is he reacting like that? Why is she, did, did she say this or that? It's other people. It's another universe. So you have no control of that. Focus what happens in here, and the results will take care of itself. Okay, guys, I hope you like it, um, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.